groups now and the numbers of new COVID cases in Erie County remain high, but there are no new restrictions being imposed. And that's what came out of a brief briefing held by Erie County Executive Mark Polencars this morning. But Polencars did use the news briefing as an opportunity to stress mask wearing in public. Steve Brown joins us now with more on that story. Hi, Steve. Hi, Kate. Yeah, I wish the news could be better, but Erie County continues to have the highest COVID uh, rate of cases, new cases ever during the pandemic. And just last week, County Executive Poland Cars, because of that, issued an emergency order for masks in public places because of all of these new cases. Just yesterday, another 832 new COVID cases. The positive test rate was a whopping 12%. Compounding the situation is that county hospitals are either full or very close to it. Poland Cars reporting that there are 100 more COVID patients in Erie County hospitals now than a year ago before vaccines were available. So the message to the public today by the county executive and the county health commissioner is to wear masks when in gatherings or in public places. If even just 10% of uh, people are masking you know, every time they go out in public, we will see a significant decrease in our hospital uh, census from COVID-19, and that'll be due to a significant decrease in the number of new COVID-19 cases. Burstein also suggested re-examining upcoming gatherings as the holiday season is approaching. She says contact tracing of the recent explosion of cases shows that much of the virus spread has happened at gatherings, both small and large. We'll have more on that coming up at 5. For now, reporting from the Information Center, Steve Brown, Channel 2 News. Kate, back to you. We'll see you then, Steve. Thank you.